What's up everyone, welcome back to our lawn and it has been cold for a couple of days now. And so we've been overdue for maintenance back here on the old backyard putting green. So I figured it's as good of a time as any. I haven't really done any applications. I haven't really done anything for several days because it's been so cold and there hasn't really been anything to do. But I figured today's a great day to walk you through what a day in the life of having a backyard putting green looks like. So I came out, I got some footage from start to finish. And it, again, I'm gonna keep repeating this for everyone. It's very simple. Um, I have my leveling rake and I just went through and swept off the worm castings and any mounds that there might be on the green. Do that, get the flag out of the way and then go right to town. Um, and I filmed a little bit of the mow. I thought I was left at greens height, but I was actually left at fairway height. So I made that adjustment mode all the surround and fairway, all the way back through there. Got that all taken care of. Picked all the sticks up first so I don't get any of those in the reel. Double cut the green since it's been a little while. You can see what it's like right there. Uh, today as well, I moved the hole because it was starting to get bad. If you leave them for a while, the ground starts to kind of fold in around the hole and it closes it off and it doesn't really work anymore. So took the cup out, cut a new hole. Thought I hit record for that, but I didn't. Um, and that was about it. And so just the, the mow all the way around, mowing the putting green, move the hole to a new location. All told, probably 30, 45 minutes today. Um, and again, that was with my daughter out here. I was helping her with her car, you know, a bunch of different things that I was doing in addition to. Um, I can check the time on mowing the green, but double cutting the green, I'm gonna guess to be three minutes. And sweeping the worm castings off now that I have the level rake takes 30 seconds. So on a day-to-day -day basis, it's a couple minutes. Um, and now we can hit a couple putts and you can see what it's rolling like. I don't know if Bryson or Adam Scott, but I still prefer having the flag out. It's gonna be quick to this whole location. Very quick. Probably about as far down the green as I can have a hole because I'm not sure this might not even stop. We'll see. Ooh, we'll stop. Check what height it's at first. I did put a little sand in here to start to try to kind of smooth out some of these areas. And then we can come back this way. And this is still, I mean, really, really thin. It's gonna take a while for this to fill in and we gotta get weeds out of here. We gotta do all sorts of stuff. Went back through here, it's okay. Looks okay. But again, this is a season long experiment to see how well 
grass will just naturally fill this in. This area back here. And there we go, quick video. I haven't been able to do a whole lot in the yard because of, you know, the temperatures. Uh, but it's about to get really nice here, so hopefully we'll be able to get uh, a little bit more content dedicated as we go along. Hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of what we're doing here in our, in our lawn with the backyard putting green, rest of the yard, all the projects we got going on. Like the video if you liked it, and we'll see you next time.